There are seven nations in the world known as the Stans, found between Russia and the Indian Ocean. In this first part, we're going to look at the flags of Afghanistan, Pakistan and Turkmenistan. If you want to know what the suffix Stan means, please check out this video. And of course, because this is Arabic, you're going to have to forgive my pronunciation. The flag of Afghanistan has had more changes since the start of the 20th century than any other country flag in the world. Afghanistan has had 20 different flags since the flag of the Hataki dynasty in 1709. The current flag was adopted by the Islamic Republic of Afghanistan in 2004 and this flag is similar to the one flown in Afghanistan during the monarchy between 1930 and 1973. The main difference being the addition of the Shahada at the top of the coat of arms, seen in yellow in the centre. The flag consists of three stripes of black, red and green. The centre of the emblem features a mosque with a pulpit and flags on either sides. Below the mosque are the numerals for the solar year 1298. This is the year 1919 in the Georgian calendar, and this is the year of Afghan independence from the United Kingdom. This central image is circled by a border consisting of sheaves of wheat on the left and the right. In the upper center is an Arabic inscription of the Muslim creed, and below this are rays of the rising sun over the Arabic expression meaning God is great. And at the bottom center there's a scroll bearing the name Afghanistan. The flag colours have official meaning, black signifies the past, red is the blood shed for independence, and green can represent either hope for the future, agricultural prosperity, or Islam. The national flag of Pakistan was adopted in its present form during a meeting of the Constituent Assembly on August 11, 1947, just four days before the country's independence. The flag is a green field with a white crescent moon and five red star at the centre, as well as a vertical white stripe at the hoist side. The green represents Islam and the majority of Muslims in Pakistan, and the white stripe is said to represent the religious minorities. In the centre, the star and crescent symbolises progress and light respectively. The flag symbolises Pakistan's commitment to Islam and the rights of religious minorities. It's based on the original flag of the Muslim League, a political group within the British Indian Raj before the Second World War, which drew its inspiration from the flags of the Sultanate of Delhi and the flag of the Ottoman Empire, as well as the flag of the Mughal Empire. The flag of Turkmenistan was adopted in January 2001. The flag is the most detailed national flag in the world, and it features a green field with vertical red stripes near the hoist side containing five carpet gulls which are designs used in the production of rugs. The gulls are stacked above two crossed olive branches similar to those in the flag of the United Nations. A white waxing crescent moon typical of Turkic and Islamic symbology and five white five pointed stars appear in the upper corner of the field just to the right hand side of the red stripe. The green and red colours appear in this flag because they have been venerated historically by the Turkmen. The waxing crescent moon symbolises the hope of the country for a shining future and the stars represent the five provinces of Turkmenistan. If you like what you've seen here, please subscribe and feel free to check out my other videos. And if you're into this sort of content, please take a look at my friend the Archives channel, as I'm sure between the two of us, we have something that would interest you.